Let's see round three of the championship here from Monza. It starts right now. Ravindra gets a pretty decent launch then off of the front of the grid as they all funnel towards turns one and two. The Variante Retafilo out there on circuit and look at them swarm their way down through this section. Son of one, and that's Cotadia taking evasive action. He's going to go straight on here as they go through and it skittles the top six. All in trouble here. Sonawana is going to skate across the gravel. There's one on his roof there. That's Cotadia who had the incident early. And that was the fear they all had. Incident at the front. It's caused everyone drivers at the front. Sonawana. I mean, yeah, Pratik Sonwane is now taking the lead. It's like bumper time for him. Steve Smuts is somehow managed to come and scratch. He's still hanging to hold on to number two. If he's able to pull off a little bit, Aditya moves in. Uh, Aro Ravindra down to sixth. Ashish Raj at number seven. Tej Patel drops down at least one position. That's down to number ten. Amit Kuti somehow claims it back to number three at the point of time. Yeah. Yeah, Steve Smuts. Trying to have a look down to the inside there at the Ascari chicane and was unable to quite find the right move at that moment to make that happen. So I think I've spoken too soon. We've got a new race leader already. Oh, no, we don't because they're going to come together here. Sonawana pretty much being hit from left to right and centre again. Mutz has got that. Now, look at this. That's a little bit greedy here. Three... Three wide into Curva Grande, almost from Aditya Pawa, who was trying to be aggressive, but he decided to back out of it at the last possible moment. He didn't want anything to do with that little moment, but they, st but they stay too wide here as they fight through Sonawana, going at it here with Amit Kuti, who is down the inside here, in towards the uh, Della Rogia, and he makes sure that he gets that one all nicely sorted out. So. Uh, Munjal Savla just goes straight on there at the first chicane and that's going to allow Aravindra a freebie, a cookie so to speak to say that he is through and he's got that one all sorted out now at the back speak so something may have just happened while we looked away and it absolutely has uh, for that driver at the front Steve Smut I believe it's going to be of the technical variety that has taken Identity Power on the offensive He's going down the inside here, and Sonawana's going to have nothing for it then. Through on the inside, and Pawa is up into the podium positions. And on the exit, ran the outside, gear it up nicely and try and get it through. Going to step aside very, very briefly, though, as Navneet Kumar jumps up into fourth position. Back with... You are right now fighting for somewhere at number four. You will take that. But I think there's a lot of hard work that he's done the last time around. So uh, he almost had this one again. He's trying to nudge a little bit, little bit of contact. Has he moved up to third? Yes, he has. Navneet Kumar up to number three. Now all he's got to do is challenge Aro Ravindra for the fight for the second position. So now it's the blade breaking that has undone them so many number of times. Aditi Power goes on the outside. Has he got the traction enough? Yes, he has. Oh, there was the bump there as they went through the corner, though, and he is shuffled out to the gravel. And he will now lose out the fine tune of two places with that one. Absolutely. We're looking here at Richard Banerjee, looking to try and get past Jamie Shaw then for eighth position right now. And it's the 16 car on the inside who looks like he's in the better place here at this moment in time as they will jam on the brakes, go into the opening corner section once again. The Retafilo straight down the inside goes Banerjee. He's up into eighth place. We have fighting hard and now could lose that ninth place has been attacking Banerjee all lap long but all of a sudden look to the left hand side goodbye two for the price of one that's the power of the double toe there Solomon you know you got to be very careful because on one hand you got to look at overtaking and on the other you got to defend so it's a two-way street every other time whether you want to take a position ahead and you're a five and you're involved in a fight for a three-way fight this gets really interesting and it's still not over we're going to be looking at corner number one as one of them is going to come on top absolutely this is the battle in towards turn number one which gets very very dicey which way do you want to go Shaw's back there in 10th position you've got Raj Tula who is the driver who gained both places and jumped up into 8th place he will hold on to that one will Raj at the moment but at this stage it is gone a little bit quiet here at the front of the field Amit and this is uh, Ragav actually knocking on, trying to get into the top five. Wide line taken then through the final corner, the Parabolica corner from Aditya Pawar. And that allows Vidiraja, Ragav down the inside. 
to pick up the place and look to move into that top five. So Richa Pawar under a bit of pressure here and on the break, he's been good, but the door is shut. He'll look back to the inside, runs out of breaking room. And in fact, they have both committed the cardinal sin of trying to use each other as the brake marker, try and beat each other to the brakes, and ultimately both of them go spearing straight on then after that run. We're going to see as Raj Tula here is having to hold off both Banerjee and Shaw. I think Shaw's doing very well. He knows that if he tries to just dive in earlier, he'll make that mistake. He's letting Raj come down. And Grisha Banerjee now sticking around with him at the moment as well. He moves to position number nine. He's got to be a little bit careful. And that's the 180. Money as he goes through. Pay him as many luck as you can as he is going to go to the final corner, the Parabolica. And he is going to prove to everybody once again that as he rides through the final corner, this is his time to shine once more. Amit Kuti will take the drive over to the start finish line and he'll take round three of VWVRC. Well done, Amit Kuti. What a drive. And when the opportunity presented himself, he just took it and he was there. And what I really liked about it, he never let took it easy and kept that gap to Aru Ravindra. Pratik Sunwani brings in the car at number four. Navneet Kumar will finish at number three. Right, right.